I chose Cambridge as a pathway because I thought it was better suited to applying overseas than like for example HSC or IB because like one it's like international which means that a lot of UK universities um, might acknowledge it better than HSC and it's also its schedule also fits better with like the academic schedule of UK universities because um, for A levels you would finish in June and then go over there in October whereas for HSC you would finish the year before. I wanted to feel my way with the AS before I completed it because I wasn't sure if I could like self-study the whole thing because of course like it is quite hard so I did want to give it a try first while still maintaining my A uh, my HSC before um, going f like fully through with it. Um, so for AS Pure Maths I got 99. Further maths, I got 93 and computer science, 91. And because I got pretty good results, I decided that I wanted to go fully through with the A-levels. So predicted grades worked um, by, I think, one of my teachers. He took my AS marks as well as looking at some of my school marks and he predicted that I would get three A-stars in the A-level. Um, my predicted grades of three A stars were sent to Oxford and so from that they gave me a conditional offer and once I meet that conditional offer it will become a solid offer. I chose Oxford because one, I really enjoyed how, like, how rich of a history it has mm -hmm. and also because of just the teaching style. It has a really unique system of the tutorial system which is where your um, you get paired up basically one-to-one -one with a tutor and you go through problem sets and learn that way. So I thought that was, I really wanted to go into that system and I thought I would really flourish in that. I was inspired by Genevieve Chen, who was a PLC student who graduated in 2021. She then went off to study computer science and philosophy at Oxford. Um, we were quite close when she was back here. We did a lot of programming together and she also guided me and helped me a lot with learning informatics. So the A-level curriculum is quite hard, even in school, so like, I guess you can imagine that it would be even harder to self-study. Uh, I had a lot of challenges with managing my time, trying to learn everything, but I think I was able to pull it off because I'm quite motivated and I really like learning, so I wasn't driven just by the marks or even by my parents. They didn't really push me at all. I was really curious to learn what the A-level syllabus had to offer and that's why I was able to finish it. PLC was really supportive in helping me through my A-level journey because my teachers were always really kind and supportive and encouraging when I was struggling with exams and also PLC just being an exam centre made my life so much easier because I didn't have to travel to and fro. In five years time I would hopefully have a Masters of Maths and Philosophy and then I would like to go on and study further, maybe doing a PhD and also I would like to see myself maybe teaching and helping other students and peers realise their full potential.